When you add and subtract fractions, you have to have the bottom numbers be the same. So that's the very first thing that we'll look for. Are the, are the denominators the same in this fraction? Yes. So we can just copy the, the number, and then we're going to add the tops. 9 plus 10 is 19. This answer is a top-heavy fraction. 19 is bigger than 6. It's improper. We have an improper fraction here. In order to make a mixed number about of it, we're going to change this through division because that's the division symbol. How many times will 6 divide into 19? Well, 6 times 3 is 18, so we're pretty close. So it goes in 3 whole times, because 6 times 3 is 18, and 1 is left over. 1, 6. So our improper fraction here was changed to a mixed number here. These are equivalent, but this one is easier to understand. We needed to have 19 6, the improper fraction, to do the math, to do the calculation. But when you got your answer, you changed it to a mixed number so it would be easier to think about. I can picture three whole, three whole pizzas and one sixth of another, but it's hard for me to picture 19 sixths of a pizza. Next problem. The denominators have to be the same. They are. So we're just going to pull over the, the, the uh, 2 to represent the size of the piece. These would be halves. That's the size of the piece. We have 4 of these halves, and we're going to add 7 more. So 4 plus 7 is 11. That makes an improper fraction. 11 is bigger than the 2. So we can divide this 11 by 2 in order to understand how many whole circles we have with our halves. Because we've got 11 of these guys, 11 of halves. 2 divides into 11. Well, 2 times 5 is 10, so I'll go with five holes, whole, pe uh, whole circles, and one remainder, remainder. So 11 halves, you can get a better picture of it if you think of it as five whole things and half of another. Are the denominators the same in this problem? Yes, just simply copy it over. Now we're going to need to add the numerators. 4 plus 5 is 9. That makes an improper fraction. 9 is bigger than 3. So we can divide. How many times does 3 divide into 9? It goes in 3, because 3 times 3 is 9. So we have 3 whole circles with no, no pieces left over. The fourth problem, are the denominators the same? Yes, they're all the same size piece. 9 plus 4 is 13. 13 is bigger than 10, so we have an improper fraction. All of these were improper fractions. The size of the piece is 10 in each circle. So we're going to divide 13 by 10 in order to see how many whole circles we can get. 10 divides into 13 one time, because 1 times 10 is 10. 11, 12, 13, with three pieces left over. Three, and what's the size of the piece? They were 10. Improper fraction? For the calculation, mixed number for the understanding of the answer.